All right, cable face pulls are a fantastic exercise for your rear delt development. They not only work well in terms of um, movement allowance, um, they're great for anyone with poor posture. If you happen to sit down a lot during the day and you end up with those routed and shoulders or a bit of pain through the back of the neck or the traps, face pulls are a great way to develop the rear of the shoulders and really improve that posture, draw your shoulders back. So they should be implemented quite often. But there's a number of ways to do them. One, be seated, two, be standing. Now, when I see people doing standing in the gym, they do a lot of throwing, whereby they're actually using momentum to generate the uh, lifting of the weight, whereas they should be really controlled, okay? You wanna be drawing the weight to you and using those muscles in particular to get the weight up, not momentum. So let me show you. You wanna actually draw the weight away. Let me get into camera here and nice and controlled. Now see how I've got a staggered stance? I've got one foot in front of the other. I'm not standing parallel. I've got one foot in front of the other to stop myself from being pulled back in by the weight. Elbows need to be nice and high at all times, okay? If I'm too low, it's a row. If I'm nice and high, it's a face pull. Use this noggin right here to draw towards the bridge of your nose. Hence the term face pull, you wanna be pulling it towards your face. Now, there's a couple of grips you can utilize. One, I like to, to have two fingers around the ball of the rope, or you can have an overhand grip. It depends on your own personal shoulder mobility, but don't be going and generating a lot of momentum to pull the weight to you. One, that means it's too heavy, and two, you're not engaging the rear of your shoulders correctly. So scale the weight back, do it properly, split stance, keep yourself nice and tight, pull the weight to you, get those elbows nice and high, and you develop those rear shoulders in no time.